back to my channel. So for this video, I'm going to be doing a tag and it is the TMI tag. I was tagged back in March to do this by my friend Serena from A Wandering Mind. So Serena, thank you so much for tagging me. And there are a lot of questions. So without further ado, let's just get started. <laughs> Question one, what are you wearing? Um, I think this is classified as a romper. Hold on. I don't even know if you guys can see. Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm so short. <laughs> yeah, um, that's what I'm wearing. Number two, ever been in love? Yes, a couple times actually, and I am still in love with my husband. Number three, ever had a terrible breakup? I feel like every breakup is terrible in my opinion. They're all so very heartbreaking. Um, but comparing the three relationships that I've ever been in my life, um, the one before I met my husband was, was very terrible. Very terrible with the breakup, so yeah. Number four, how tall are you? I'm a shorty. I am five foot three or five foot two. I guess it depends on who measures me. Five, how much do you weigh? I weigh, it fluctuates between like 107 and 109, so around there. Yeah. Number six, any tattoos? No, but I've been thinking about maybe getting one sometime in the future. But the thing is, I don't know what I would want and I don't know where I would want it. And also, I am deadly afraid of needles. Seven, any piercings? Yes, just my ears. Eight, OTP. So I know this means one true pairing after Googling it. And I'm not sure if this is talking about like one true pairing like in a TV show or in a book. I can't think of an OTP at the moment. I'm gonna have to pass on that. <laughs> Number nine, favorite show. Oh gosh, dang it, favorite show? Shoot, um, at the top of my head, I think I'll say Ranch. It's on Netflix, love that show. My husband and I like binge watch every series. Number 10, favorite bands. I don't really have a favorite band. I don't listen to music a lot. Um, the only time I really listen to music is in the car or if my husband decides to play iHeartRadio on his phone or if I'm just in the mood to listen to a specific song. 11, something you miss. I miss hanging out with friends without my kids. I've mentioned before in previous videos that I'm with my kids like literally 24-7. There's hardly a time where they're without me or I'm without them unless we're like visiting family and our family can watch them so I can go hang out with my sister or go on a date with my husband. But I really miss just hanging out with friends, just going out to meet for coffee or lunch and I haven't done that in a very long time. And I also miss going on dates with my husband too now that we're on this topic. Hopefully. The next time we visit family we can go on a date since we weren't able to do that last time so i miss that i miss date nights number 12 favorite song wanted um wanted by hunter hayes that will always be one of my favorite songs because um it made me think it makes me think of promise and that was also the song that we danced to at our wedding so it has a very special place in my heart and gives me all the feels number 13 how old are you i am 25 and i will be 26 on Halloween this year and my father loves to remind me that I'm inching closer and closer to 30 and that I'm becoming a very old woman so yeah that's always fun love you dad love you so much 14 zodiac sign um, uh, hold on I don't know let me google this real quick so I'm a Scorpio <laughs> I can never remember that 15 quality you look for in a partner I guess if I have to name one quality, um, that would be someone who puts their family um, first, someone who's very family oriented. So that's like one of the qualities that I look for. Okay, number 16, favorite quote. So one of my favorite quotes for me is, the best preparation for tomorrow is doing your best today. And that is by H. Jackson Brown Jr. And that is one of my favorites because I'm constantly stressing about the future and I just have to remember to focus on today and doing my best today. And if I just have a really bad day, then just remember that tomorrow's a new day and just try again. 17, 
favorite actor. I said it before and I'll say it again. Jackie Chan, love him. 18, favorite color, purple. 19, loud music or soft? Uh, that depends on my mood actually. Sometimes I like loud music when maybe like I'm cleaning and then other times if I just want to like really relax then I would pick soft music. 20. Where do you go when you're sad? I sometimes sneak away into my bedroom and shut the door. 21. How long does it take you to shower? About 10-15 minutes. My husband would say longer than that. I don't know. 22. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Well, if I decide to do my makeup and hair, it takes what feels like all morning because I'm very slow with that. Um, but if I don't decide to do my hair or makeup, which is like almost every day, uh, it just takes me about 15 minutes. 23. Ever been in a physical fight? No. 24. Turn on. I don't know. 25. Turn off. Someone being very mean and making rude comments for no reason, I guess. 26. The reason I joined YouTube. To talk about books and to make friends, which I have, so that's awesome. 27. Fears. Um, something happening to my kids. Uh, something happening to my husband. Not being able to see my family in the Philippines ever again. That's the fear of mine, so... Yeah. 28. Last thing that made you cry. Uh, it's some dumb argument that Thomas and I got into. You know, those things. 29. Last time you said you loved someone. This afternoon, before, right before my husband left to go on a eight mile walk. 35. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. Friend. 36. Favorite food. I have a lot of those, but I'm gonna say lumpia. It's so delicious. It's, it's one of those Filipino foods. If you've ever tried one, you know. Um, if you don't know what it is, I'll probably insert a picture here. And basically, it's like a Filipino version of an egg roll, but in my opinion, so much better. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I just, yeah, that's as best as I could describe it, but it doesn't taste like an egg roll. That makes sense. 37, place you want to visit. I really want to visit Ireland. I think that'd be really fun to visit. I'd also love to visit Italy. Uh, 38. Last place you were? Church. 39. Do you have a crush? Well, I have several book crushes. <laughs> well, I mean, does my husband count? Because I always have a crush on him. 40. Last time you kissed someone? Um, this afternoon, before my husband went on his walk. 41. Last time you were insulted? Probably sometime in the last year. 42. Favorite flavor of sweet? I love strawberry flavored stuff. They're my favorite. 43. What instrument do you play? I could play a little bit of the piano. 44. Favorite piece of jewelry? I love bracelets. 45. Last sport you played? Gymnastics. 46. Last song you sang? Part of that world from The Little Mermaid. I was singing that to Gabby. Uh, 47. Favorite chat up line? <laughs> There's no favorite chat up line for me. 48. Have you ever used it? No. Goodness, no. That is like a one way ticket to embarrassment bill for me. That the thought of me using a chat up line is just so embarrassing. <laughs> that I feel like I would never recover from. 49, last time you hung out with anyone. Fifty, who should answer these questions next? Okay, so, don't know who has or has not done it, but I am going to pick uh, Mia from Select Pages. So Mia, you are tagged if you haven't done it, and if you'd like to do it, please do so. And anyone else that is interested in answering all these TMI questions, <laughs> I tag you as well. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this wasn't too boring. I hope you enjoyed it. And hopefully I'll see you again in my next video. Bye, guys.